Hello, my name is Eric. I'm a member of the support team here at Prototech. In this video, we're going to take a sneak peek at a new option that will be available in the upcoming release of Mastercam 2025. You may already be familiar with the deburr toolpath that is part of the multi-axis seat. New for Mastercam 2025, Mill and Mill 3D customers and the router equivalents can now purchase a 3D version of the deburr toolpath. I can see here in my 3D gallery, I now have a deburr three axis. I'm gonna select an eighth inch ball. I will select the whole part. I can set a width. Tool axis control is limited to just three axis. I hit okay and it will basically break every edge that that tool can reach. I have a stock model already in this part that basically represents the finished part. I'm gonna launch my verify. I'm gonna run the simulation. I can see that with one easy toolpath, it deburrs my entire part, even giving me constant finishes along 3D shapes. Doesn't get much easier than that. This part also has some intersecting holes. I'm gonna choose the deburr three axis again. This time I'm gonna choose a lollipop cutter. For machine geometry, I'll once again select the entire part so that it's model aware. This time I'm gonna use a different option. I'm gonna to choose to select which edges to deburr. And I'm gonna pick where these holes intersect. This toolpath makes these complex chamfers easy. I run my verification on this new cut and I can see that I get a nice even chamfer along this 3D shape. If you have any additional questions on this new feature or are interested in it, don't hesitate to reach out. Thanks for watching this video on one of the many new enhancements coming to Mastercam 2025.